Okay guys, uh, hopefully this finds you both well. Um, hopefully everybody's doing good. So I just kind of hopped up without a ladder here. Um, yeah, unfortunately um, Sun UV is going to do that. Uh, I'm so sorry, you guys lost a ton of trees. I haven't been up this street in a while and oh my goodness. We have definitely lost a lot of trees right here. So, sorry to hear that. Unfortunately, uh, that's gonna give you that UV. Good thing is though, uh, you do have a couple and, uh, and they will, they'll come back bigger than ever. You got a couple of little cedars there too. So it will, they will come back and it will get nice again. But yeah, you can tell the house is taking a little bit of a hit from all the um, uh, UV as well, so I think when I do the deck I might do a little round of touch-ups and so forth and help you guys out there But it appears to be just your good old-fashioned UV damage um, And and it's just kind of time so uh, This could go I'm gonna jump down This could go actually a couple different ways um, We could come we could clean the slats out um, and we could pressure wash it really good with some bleach solution and try to clean the deck up really good and Try to get rid of a lot of the black stuff and from all the cedar here This this is the cedar that's doing it and then with a the UV um, And then we could stain it and we could use an Armstrong which I've been using Armstrong for a couple of years really good stuff and we could come in and we could stain the whole darn thing and walk away and and uh, and we could do that and then we could also um, the next step would be a refinish so I will find a, a way to put either of those in on this job uh, depending on what you would like to do but I will leave it completely and absolutely up to you but uh, now a refinish would actually rejuvenate the deck completely and that would entail us coming in with a hand sander and trimming this board out with a hand sander and then taking a big huge uh, our floor sander and running this floor and running that floor up there and just sanding it to bare wood and then we'd also uh, sand these steps by hand each one down and we'd sand the top rail we would not sand obviously this guy um, they don't really need it we just pressure wash those really good so that would be a refinish and in the best uh, uh, situation, the refinish would look absolutely amazing. Um, and we could use an Armstrong. And even if we didn't want to go to that distance, we could definitely come in and do a, um, we could definitely come in and just do a restain. You know, we should come in, uh, clean it off really good, and we come in and just restain it. And that could be something as well. Um, either way, on these uh, for what I would suggest is either way we would do the outside beam we do the beams and we do the outside now granted I know they're pressure treated uh, but I think it would look really good if we did all the outside because that pressure treat's going to start to fade now granted the pressure treated lasts longer than normal and that's a great thing but that doesn't change the fact that uh you know it does last longer than normal but it does you don't want to have it get too beat up by the sun the sun will get a hold of it so uh, i could restain all the outsides all the outsides pretty much a complete stain except for we probably would not uh stain underneath that deck because it still looks good or underneath this deck just the ceiling areas you know what i mean so we wouldn't we wouldn't do this stuff right there. There's no need to get into that. But all uh, the beams and both sides of them and everything else. We do a ton of these um, that we come in and do deck refinishing. So it could, I'll, I'll send you the cost for both. I'll definitely make you guys a deal. Um, and we can kind of get in and take a look. But yeah, I think it might be smart just to put a, a coat on the pressure trees. It doesn't take that long. And it'd be a weekend, probably three guys on a Saturday. Um, and then Sunday after church, maybe, um, or two Saturdays, uh, depending on, uh, we don't like to skip our church. So we've been pretty good with that too. So yeah, I just, I'm, I pulled up and I go, oh my goodness, where all the trees go? 
but you know that's the thing that sometimes happens living up here in the mountains sometimes we get hit by these deals but not a big deal it shall return but so that's where we're at um, I would suggest one of two things just a clean and stain or a clean refinish and uh, stain so I'll put those together and send them over we can get them done before weather comes in we'll probably get them done actually in August even so that's where we are at hopefully this finds both of you in an awesome health and everything else is good I can't wait to sit down and talk about Berlin and uh, hear about the homeland so hey have a great day and we'll talk soon bye